Hi, I am Dr. Sulata Shanoi, Psychologist and Director, Turning Point, Center for Psychological Assessments, Therapies and Counseling, Jainagar, Bengaluru. Most mental disorders will also have some kind of physiological or bodily symptoms or manifestations such as palpitations, arrhythmia, irregular heartbeat and a lot of times the anxiety or the feelings of dread or uh, depression that are associated with mental disorders also lead to the heart racing faster than normal, skipping a heartbeat or any other such bodily symptoms. When that happens, naturally one is very concerned about the palpitations and whether it is a purely physiological uh, difficulty which one needs to seek medical attention or is it part of the larger psychological disturbance. Whatever it is, I would suggest that one should first go in for a medical opinion about your heart and see whether this is this is something that can be treated by itself or it should be treated as part of the mental disorder. In obsessive compulsive disorder or OCD, what happens is that the person has very disturbing and anxiety provoking thoughts for which the person resorts to some kind of actions in which to alleviate those anxiety provoking symptoms leading to a temporary relief of those anxious thoughts but one is back again after some time with the same thoughts. So it's a vicious circle that goes round and round in the patient's mind and along with this is also associated palpitations when one is in the anxiety provoking state. In cases of depression, what happens is that the person may feel withdrawn, may feel uh, anxious, may feel a lot of times uh, uh, to be uh, seen to be crying and in a very sad and upset mood. And along with this, it is but natural for the depressed patient to feel some amount of anxiety which may ag again provoke palp heart palpitations and feelings of uh, unease or feelings of dread in the person. In panic attacks, the person is suddenly uh, feels or suddenly experiences a wave of uh, anxiety which causes a lot of physiological disturbances such as excessive sweating or cold palms or uh, upset uh, stomach or palpitations or numbness and such other like feelings and a person may be sometimes mistaken to be having any kind of medical disorder rather than the, these symptoms stemming from the psychological disorder. So what one needs to do, do in all these three conditions if one is having palpitations is to first take, take stock of the situation that this, these palpitations are a part and parcel of the mental disorder and many times may need treatment and psychotherapy. You may be told that it is okay, just slow down your heart rate, nothing is going to happen, after all this is all in the mind. But this is very difficult for a patient to follow and I would suggest professional advice in dealing with these anxiety symptoms. What happens is that the body is in a fight or flight mode in which the uh, autonomic nervous system produces these symptoms for the person to face the challenges of the anxiety provoking situation not knowing that these are mostly men symptoms stem from mental instability or disturbance and not from the surroundings. The body does not know and the, the palpitations, the irregular heartbeats can be as threatening and as devastating as having a real heart attack or any other heart disorder. So take stock of the situation and with treatment, I would certainly emphasize treatment and psychotherapy, you will learn how to slow down and how to take, uh, be realistic and also lot of steps can be taught to the patient in order for the person to 
calm down and resume normal life again.